What's up guys, so it's day one at Grid Life South. We're out here in Atlanta, Georgia. Uh, we just did one session with the R32, and then we just got back. It just got a little wet out here, but we just did a session, first session with the 34. It is so fucking sick, my God. I'm like so pumped. Uh, we got Phil, AKA the Space Cat, remoting in right now, just kind of dialing in the tune. And then uh, we're gonna go back out there and send it. But I'm like, literally like my hair is rising. This car is fucking unbelievable. If we can, <laughs> see we're doing tune. a little uh, little remote tune. Remote tune. Kind of clean some uh, clean some stuff up here. Ooh. Yeah, so we're out here. It's a uh, third session. Uh, we had to. We're still trying to sort out the 34 a little bit. We had to put a different fuel pump in it, so we're taking the old uh, beater slash backup car out. Fucking cutout so annoying. Manji, all the streets! Stop cutting out! <laughs> Ooh, let's follow these boys. This is not, this has been a pretty horrible weekend. I don't want to speak too soon, but I think we have the R32 maybe working for today, which would be beautiful because it's like so many of you guys that have ride alongs and like we <laughs> feel like shit about it. Like we're trying to, we're doing like VIP ride alongs where if you like buy a t shirt or something like that, we'll like put you ahead of the line and stuff. And we had literally like 30 of you guys do it and we haven't, we've been able to give one ride along. It's like, just such a mess and but the 34 is pretty screwed uh, I don't know if we're gonna say names yet but it's pretty obvious who put the fuel system in I think it was the guy who did the fabrication and we for one he didn't clean out the lines and that's caused us issues last event and this event secondly when he put the pump together in the fuel cell he cut out the foam and didn't clean it out. And so there's foam and debris in the lines showing up in the injectors. The lines that he used aren't ethanol rated, <laughs> which we talked so long ago about running Ignite Red. And I partnered with them so long ago. And we we're like, yes, we're running ethanol. We need an ethanol rated fuel system. And we got the injectors cleaned last night 
and we may just run it and see um, but if the lines are in fact not ethanol rated which uh, a couple people have told me they believe they aren't from looking at them um, then it's just getting clogged up again and then we're gonna have to redo the whole fuel system so yeah I don't know this is super long-winded but the, we're just getting our asses handed to us again and again by these fucking cars 34 is pretty screwed but this guy I think we may have working so we're gonna go try it we don't really have any way to test it so we just have to use each session to kind of see what happens and work with what we got so we have like 30 ride-alongs we need to try to get through so hopefully it works <laughs> Tickets at the door, it's you on a guest list, you plus four, make sure you bring some bad bitches, I've been sleeping on a bus, got me sore, for about a month smoking blunts, and we just started something that was great, had me waking up each day like damn this chick is dope, let's pray it last, I really hope it does, and usually I don't, cause usually it won't. All we need's a little push We're scared of this, we're scared of us Our feelings we can barely trust This booze got us impaired as we're in love That's just the drugs Don't they make you feel numb? You can't feel it at all Maybe if we loved ourselves It wouldn't be so hard it Wouldn't be so hard To love each other I don't think we're in love That's just the drugs So hard, wouldn't be so hard 